Hi everybody, I'm uh, Margul Fump. In this video, I'll be playing Fiction Fixers Adventures in Wonderland. This is a cute little game from 2011 where you play through the famous book, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland. I like the setup for this. There's an evil villain named Victor Vile, and he hates reading. At last, the halls of fiction. I'll just take a quick look inside. His evil plan is to destroy all books ever. Ooh, what a villain. I love what they've done with the place. Oh my, what have we here? Ah, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland. This will work perfectly. My plans are coming together, and the fiction fixers have no idea. There is nothing they can do to stop me. Nothing at all. <laughs> Welcome to the fiction fixers. Cadet, we have a high priority case for you, and I'm not going to send you in there alone and unprepared. Fixer Phoebe will be accompanying you. She is one of the department's finest. I'll be shadowing you on this assignment. Don't worry, you'll have an extra set of eyes and ears in the field. No one will even know I'm there, except you. We will also be outfitting you with the proper Fiction Fixer equipment. Let's get started. Alrighty, so I'm one of the fiction fixers. I need to fix all the damage that Victor Vile has caused. Let's start by looking at the case file. Fixers, there was a massive break-in at the Halls of Fiction, and many valuable books were stolen. We have reason to believe that an illiterati agent is behind this headache. Of the books stolen, you two will be heading into an important classic, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll. Use this dossier to keep notes of your findings as you go. Sure thing, Chief. This will basically serve as our journal for the rest of the game. I really love the name Illiterati. That, that's a funny name for a group that's dedicated to destroying books. Oh, that reminds me. Cadet, here is your fictionizer. This device allows you to interact inside the story. So this will be our hint button. And finally, we have the map. And lastly, don't forget your map. This map has important indicators and tips on where you can go next, should you get stuck. All right, fixers, pick up anything important along the way and stop that illiterati agent. Now get in there and get to work. We'll do our best, Chief. Let's get going, partner. All right. I'm sure I'll solve the case, Chief. Doing all right, partner? Your first fictionizing can be a bit rough, but it gets easier. It looks like Alice has already gone into the rabbit hole. Let's find it and get down there. All right, so we are already in the book, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland. Uh, let's find the rabbit hole. It's pretty easy to find it. It's over here on the left. You see those sparkles? That's where it is. And we have a puzzle, a very simple puzzle. You want to click on the things of grass to uncover the hole like this. Great, so now we're gonna go through the rabbit hole and see how deep it goes. Whoa, this is one big rabbit hole. I don't see Alice anywhere. She must be further down. Pick up as many heavy objects as you can so we can catch up to her. And this is another puzzle. You wanna click on the things that are falling. Some things are falling up and uh, the heavy things are always falling down because they're heavy. So we need to click on, uh, I don't know, 
20 different heavy objects. Just a lot of heavy objects. Click on them all. It's, it's a little hard because we've got like balloons and stuff covering up, covering up our view. You did it! There she is. We're catching up. Oh, is she asleep? <sighs> That's probably for the best. I guess we'll meet her at the bottom then. Now we need to keep our eyes open for this alliterati agent and fix what they're changing. Wait, who is that? Ah, fiction fixers. They sent you to try and stop me. Laughable at best. Hold it right there. Come and get me, fiction fixers. Oh no, he stuffed the leaf pile full of sharp objects. We need to get them out of there so Alice doesn't land on them. That's how the game works. Uh, Victor Vile is going to try to mess up the story. We're going to try to fix the story. So he tried to mess it up. Alice is going to land on a bunch of sharp stuff and she will be impaled. We don't want that to happen. We're going to save her. And this is going to be a hidden objects challenge. We need to find all the items listed at the bottom of the screen. And if you get stuck, you can click on the hint button for a hint. So I'm just going to click on various sharp items and hope I find them. An axe, a cane sword, a nails are over here, a harpoon, a wooden stake, a musket, uh, the weather vane is over there, iron spike, ooh, that was a chisel, a hand axe, a harpoon, a medieval axe, it's that one. Okay, and I'll use a hint for the final one so you can see what hints look like. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can't even see that thing, it's totally covered by leaves. That'll do it. Alice should land safely. Hooray! So you can click on Alice to talk to her. I do wonder how far I've fallen, and I wonder where I could possibly be. I say, who are you? Are you lost down this rabbit hole as well? Come now, I'm sure that white rabbit knows the way. Let's find him. Excellent, excellent. So we're gonna go over here. Here we are, the famous glass table. But where's the key? The shrinking potion is gone too? Quick, make a new one so Alice can go down there and look for the key. Yes, Alice finds a shrinking potion towards the start of her adventures in Wonderland. This is a puzzle. It's a repeat the pattern puzzle. Green, red, blue. Green, red, blue, green. Green, red, blue, green, yellow. Hey, hey, I did it. Great, and now I have the uh, shrinking potion. Let's give Alice the shrinking potion. Place your mouse over the inventory. Next, click on the shrinking potion. Now, click on Alice to give her the shrinking potion. Mm-hmm. Well, this bottle doesn't appear to be poison. I suppose this cannot be bad for me. Oh, what a curious feeling. I must be shutting up like a telescope. And now Alice has shrunk down. She's very tiny. Oh, my. I hope I don't keep shrinking. Otherwise, I won't exist at all. Oh, well, that would be very sad. And here we have another hidden objects challenge. We need to find a uh, drumsticks and a feather, feather, uh, a cinnamon stick. I clicked on something, but I that wasn't what I was trying to find. Uh, um, boots. There's some boots. We need to find a uh, straight razor, glove, a parasol. Cupcake. Yum, cupcake. That's the item we want to find. That's the item uh, Alice needs to get. Uh, we have two dice. Uh, two pairs of dice, actually. A telephone. And I'll use a hint for the cinnamon stick. Oh, it was hidden on the scarf stripe. Ooh, that's tricky. All 
right, Alice, here is your growth cake. I'll eat this, and if it makes me bigger, I should be back to normal size. Whoa, 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 too much, too much! I think she ate a bit too much of that cake. How am I ever going to get down? Hello down there, feet. I do wonder if I will ever see you again. I'm late. I'm terribly late. I'll never make it to the Queen's Garden at this rate. There's that curious rabbit. I wonder where he's off to. I, I should point out, we've got a bunch of items. Like, we've got a gear in the background there. We've got a gear in the background here. We also have a puzzle. We can't solve it quite yet. We need something to undo nails. A hammer. We're gonna have to get a hammer. And then down here, we had a button. Right, so let's go back to Alice. We are going to shrink her down with more shrinking potion. Perhaps I should drink a little less this time. Yes, that would be good. That certainly is much better. Okay, so let's continue. I would love to follow that rabbit to the Queen's Garden, as I am certain it is lovely. But which way did he go? I'll bet he went behind this curtain. So, we go down here for a puzzle. Oh, man. This is kind of a tricky puzzle, and it's a three-part puzzle, unless I'm mistaken. Okay, I got the first round uh, pretty easy, and now I have no idea what to do with anything else. Uh, does that go there? Nope. Oh, that goes up there. Yeah, you can tell if you've got it right, because the piece will snap into place. That looks good, and those go together? Yes. Um, that one works. Which means this here and this there. Finally, I have no idea where any of this stuff goes. Let's see. Um, there? No. I'm just trying all sorts of spots. Oh, no. <laughs> I was trying that because it was a, a, a rather large piece, but I suppose that was a terrible idea on my part. Hmm, let's see. What can go in this corner? Like this here, maybe? No. I think I was on the right track by trying to figure out where to put this rather large piece. Oh, is that it? I think that's it. Rather large piece is in place. Great, so that means this goes here. Nice. That's gotta go there. That piece there. Um, that there. Got it. Oh, I should point out, you could use the uh, hint button to skip a puzzle if you want. So here we're going to use the uh, chisel, giving us this space. We're going to put the button in it. Press the button. Oh my, there are so many doors. How will I ever find that rabbit? Now, I don't think they have this in Alice in Wonderland. They just have this for uh, the video game, because we've got five different areas of the game. Let's see. We need to use this key here. Uh, the key does not match any of the other doors, so that's why we know it's uh, the, this particular key. You want to rotate the rings to make the keyhole. Oh, and there are two gears here. Can't forget the gears. We are collecting gears for a gear puzzle. Oh my, who is that? There he is, the literati agent. We meet again, fiction fixers. I see you're making some progress. Well, that stops right now. <laughs> Oh, no! That strange man stole the signs. I couldn't possibly know which way to go. 
Well, Alice isn't going any further till we fix this. So let's see if we can find those signs. I do like how the sign post is made like a fork. It's a giant fork in the road. <laughs> okay, so we're going to look over here. We're going to find all these items, shall we? Like, there's a mouse. Uh, that is not a castle, but the game says it's a castle. Um, there's a mushroom. We've got four mushrooms. Let's see. We need a hedgehog over here. Little spade. June bug. Magnet. It's not obvious unless you replay the game, uh, a few times. But, uh, the, the list of items you need to find changes every single time. It's a, it's a little randomized. It's a little randomized. So I'll use a hint. Hint says that's an arrowhead. Those are the mushrooms and that's the horn. Now would be a good time to check the map. Click the map button. The blinking circle indicates your current location. The exclamation points indicate areas that currently require investigation. Sometimes backtracking will be necessary. We should expect to visit areas more than once. Let's close the map and check out those areas. So we can do something at the fork in the road, the hall of doors, or the rabbit hole bottom. I, I think the map is useful, but at the same time, maybe not the, the most useful. So here at the hall of doors, we're going to go here at the mouse hole. We're going to use the magnet. And that gives us a hammer. Yeah, but here's the thing. We have these doors, right? We have all these doors. We need to open up every single one of those doors. So it still says, hey, exclamation mark, there's something to do here. But it's all stuff we can't do yet. We don't have any of those keys. So that's where I think the map could be improved. It's not entirely useful. Um, but we can solve the puzzle here. We can solve this puzzle now. It says there's a puzzle here. We can solve it. We are opening this with a hammer. And that gives us the signposts. Excellent. So let's go back over here and put the sign on the signpost. Good. And now we can go to the rabbit's house. Over on the right will be the mad tea party. I simply cannot walk down a road that does not have a sign. What if I get lost and cannot find my way back? Well, I don't think the sign will help you find your way back if you get lost, but whatever! Let's go see the rabbit. Oh no! Oh no! I'm late! But how late am I? My watch, it appears to be broken! My whiskers, oh, if only I had the proper pieces, it could be fixed! Look! It's the white rabbit! Oh, we must help him fix his watch! Oh no! Oh no! Alright, so we're going to zoom in on his watch. We need to put everything into place. So, I do not have all the gears, it looks like. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Failure for Argolfomp now. Uh, let's put these... Um, I guess those gears are of a moderate size. But, yeah, I need two more gears. Two more gears. Where am I going to find the two missing gears? Well, there's one. There's one right there. Uh, oh, and there's one right there. Hey, <laughs> I found them very quickly. Great. So let's solve the puzzle. That there and that there, perhaps? Good, all the gears are in the right spots. You've done it! You fixed my watch! Oh my dear paws! Oh my fur and whiskers, I'm late! She'll have me executed! I must hurry to the garden. Oh, Marianne, would you run in and fetch me a pair of gloves and a fan? Marianne? He took me for his housemaid. He'll be surprised when he finds out who I am. But I'd better take him his fan and gloves, if I can find them. We are going to have several puzzles before we can go inside the house, because the house needs a doorknob. Excellent. So let's go into the woods over here. How are we to get by with all these thick trees in the way? I wonder if we can find something to cut them down. Yeah, a couple of puzzles. So let's see. We want to go here. Large nest, we want to get past the spider, and we want to get those things cut down. I think the map says 
we now have a hidden objects challenge at the rabbit hole bottom. So let's go and solve it. Taking a look at those trees is what caused the hidden objects challenge to appear. Oh, I thought we got all of these the last time. We Might as well clean them up, just to be safe. We're gonna look here now. So let's see, we need a sword, a saw, a saw. I think the saw is the item that we're gonna use to cut down those tree branches, right? That makes sense. Uh, obsidian arrow there. A bear trap there. Cane sword, metal needle. Nails, nails, yeah, we got nails last time. So that's what I mean about the uh, list of items being a little bit randomized. I think it's something like, well, there are like 20 different, or 20 to 30 different possible items which could appear at the bottom of the screen, and the game picks them at random. Although there are some items which are important, which will always appear. In this case, it's the axe is the important item, because we're, we're here. That's why we're solving this puzzle. We're trying to find an axe. I need to find a sword. Uh, there's the obsidian arrowhead. There's the sword. Yeah. Oh, it's a saw, not an axe. Okay, well, the saw is the item that always appears when you're solving that hidden objects challenge then. How are we to get by with all these thick trees in the way? I wonder if we can find something to cut them down. We How certainly we can. Okay, I guess I need to use the saw on the tree branches first. And this gives us a puzzle very much like the puzzle to get into the rabbit hole. Just click on all the branches. All the branches blocking your way. Woo! Very easy. Oh my! A giant puppy! I would love to play with him. If only I had a toy for him to chew on. Look at his fur. The poor thing is covered in bugs. Aw, it's the giant puppy! The giant puppy is in uh, the Alice in Wonderland book. Now's our chance. Let's get some of those bugs off of him. I don't think the giant puppy I I is in uh, all the movies, though. Okay, so we're gonna look here. Uh, this is a puzzle. We need to click on various bugs as they jump across the screen. Doesn't really matter which bugs you click on. You can click on the large ones. You could click on the small ones. As long as you click on 10 bugs. Ew! I've never seen so many bugs in my life. Wait, what is that in his fur? We have two items here. So let's see, we've got the doorknob and we've got the bugs. We're gonna go back. We're gonna use the bugs over here on the left for the spider. That was so gross. I can't believe you did that. Yes, yeah, step into my lair, said the spider to the fly. So we're going to take a look at this here. The key opens up the toolbox. We need to remember this number, 24146. And the number changes every time you play the game, 24146. So you do have to remember it. So I'm going to put the doorknob into place and use the oil can. Now where can his gloves and fun be? They're over here. It was 24146. There we go. Got it. Look, what did Alice get into now? I found another bottle. I wonder what this one will do. I know something interesting is bound to happen. Uh-oh. Not again. Alice, stop. Stop. That's quite enough. I hope I don't grow anymore. I cannot get out of the door. Oh, I do wish I hadn't drunk quite so much. Alice has made a mess of this house. We need to find something to shrink her down, or we'll never get out of here. Oh, dear. This is probably a good time to show off the journal. Here's what the journal looks like. 
It explains the story and all the stuff that we've seen so far. Occasionally it gives like little clues. Let's see if I can find it. Uh, I, I'm going to skip ahead. Yeah, it's a pretty thorough record of everything we've done. And here it gives the code 24146. So here in the house we need to solve two puzzles, uh, two hidden objects challenges. So we need to find the four rabbits. And then a minute hand. The minute hand always appears here. So let's see, fire poker, wooden button. Oh no! If you click too many times in a row, you get uh, in trouble like that. Spectacles, spectacles. And then a dandelion, and a strange, strange cake. There's a strange cake. We still need to find a teapot it's over here. A uh, pocket watch. A stuffed rabbit. Where could that stuffed rabbit be? There it is. And I'll use a hint for the wooden button. There we go. We'll give the cake to Alex. If I eat this cake, it's sure to make some change in my size. Hopefully it will bring me down to the proper size. Dear me, am I back to normal now? It's becoming hard to tell. Is anything normal here in Wonderland? I don't know, let's go upstairs. I love this carrot, it's a giant carrot. There's no explanation for it, it's just giant carrot in the rabbit's house. Uh, I wanna grab that jewel. I will grab the shovel later on. I think that's for the tea party. And I'll solve the hidden objects challenge. Let's see if we can find all the items here. Uh, candlestick. Uh, the magic key. Yeah, that's the important item. The key there, it opens up one of, the, one of those doors in the hall of doors. I'm looking for a coin, a ring, and a cane. Hmm. I don't see any of those items. There's a statue. Uh, there's the ring, so I'll use the hint for the coin. That's a coin? I thought that was just a decoration on a pillow. Alrighty, Mr. Rabbit, here are your gloves and fan. Marianne! Wait, wait! You're not Marianne! Thank you, kind girl. No, sir. I am not Marianne, but you are welcome. Dear me! I'm late! I must be off to the Queen before it's off with my head! Wait, excuse me, sir. Which way is it to the Queen's Garden? Oh, he's already gone. We must find him. Oh, bother. So we are going to chase after him. And one of these doors. Let's see, it's a bug-shaped key. I think it's this door. Yeah, that's it. Oh, and this is the really difficult one, I think. I, I'm not sure. I think it's tough. Okay. Yo! Oh, man, I got it. Wow, first try. Okay, well then... Oh, wait, no, that's not first try. It is, in fact, more difficult than I thought. Okay, I th thought thought I had it done. That keyhole looks great. I think I've got the two inner rings upside down. And by moving them right side up again, I moved the outside rings. Oh dear. Okay. No! No. Good. No. I'll just try that again. Got it. Okay. I do wonder where this door will take us. Perhaps this is the one that brings us to that lovely garden. Alice, I don't know why you think the Queen's Garden is lovely. I, I don't think we're going to have fun times there. Well, I say, who are you? And where are you off to? Oh my, a talking caterpillar? My name is Alice, sir. I'm trying to find my way to the Queen's lovely garden. I might be able to help you if you can help me as well. What could I possibly help you with, sir? 
You see, I've misplaced an old pipe that is very important to me. I believe it to be lost somewhere very near, my dear. All right, let's help the caterpillar. The pipe is here in this hidden objects challenge. I think that's it right there. Uh, two loaves of bread. He's a hungry, hungry caterpillar. A salamander and a fishing pole. Oh, yes, the fishing pole. Grapes and glasses. Oh, I'll just use a hint. That's the salamander. Green gem. A toad, an apple, and a scarf. No, toad and lawn bowling ball. I'm not sure what that is. There's the toad. There's the lawn bowling ball. So I need grapes, glasses, and a hammer. Oh dear me! So so you'll notice that the hidden uh, I mean the hint button is slowly refilling. You can't just use 500 hints in a row. No, you have to wait a while. You have to wait like a minute in between hints. See if I can find any of these items in the meantime. There's the glasses. I don't know what I clicked on. Grapes. So here's a cheat. You hit on the menu button and then hit play. And that automatically resets your hint timer. That way you can use a bunch of hints in a row. Without having to wait. So here you go, Mr. Caterpillar. Here's your pipe. Excuse me, sir. Is this what you were looking for? Oh, many, many thanks, kind girl. Might you tell me where to find the Queen's Garden? Since you were so kind, I'll tell you a riddle. Should you solve it, your way will be a bit more clear. A riddle? I do love riddles. Ah, so with this riddle, you don't want the cats to ever outnumber the mice. The way to do that is by sending two cats across, then one cat back, then two cats across. That way you have all three cats on the right-hand side. So when you send one to the left, you can send two mice to the right. And yeah, now the mice are safe. Now we need a, a cat and a mouse over here on the left. So we can send two mice across. And now the cats can never outnumber the mice. So uh, I send one cat back to grab two cats. I send one cat back to grab two cats. Puzzle solved. Well done. Well done. I happen to have a key to a door that should bring you one step closer to your goal. Thank you, sir. Until we meet again, I hope you find your way. Thank you very much, sir. So, I think the key opens up this, maybe? No, must be this door. Ah, it's the very pretty key. Oh dear, how am I going to do this? Let's see, I think it looks like this. Oh no, the one in the middle is just spinning endlessly. Oh, there we go. That wasn't so bad. Maybe this time I can get to the Queen's Garden. No, no, we're going to meet the Duchess, Alice. For the Duchess, an invitation from the Queen to play croquet. I don't see any invitation, good sir. If I may ask, what are you playing at? Well, I, I had an invitation in a rather large envelope. Where has it gone? I wonder if that nasty man has something to do with this. I think Victor Vile is responsible. We're going to grab that ladder and we're going to use the ladder to find the invitation. Over here, I believe. Mm, yes, the bird likes fish. So we're actually going to go fishing first. Otherwise, we can't get the invitation.
Excellent, and I'll double check the map saying nothing else to do. I mean, we've got stuff to do in the rabbit house interior and the fork in the road. Like, we've got so many things to do everywhere, though. It's like, well, we won't be able to solve this puzzle in a while. We need to get a spear. That's what we need to solve that puzzle. And we need the other sign part. Well, we can't solve this puzzle. We don't. We can't even get the other sign part yet. So, let's give the envelope here. Oh, well, which one do I give it to? The messenger? Here is your letter, sir. Why, thank you, little girl. Ah, yes, yes. Where were we? As I was saying, an invitation from the Queen to play croquet. I thank you, good sir, on behalf of the Duchess. I shall see that this is delivered immediately. I bid you good day, sir. Sir, might I go in to see the Duchess about the Queen's croquet game? Indeed, might you. Simply go up to the door and enter. Sounds good. Oh my, there's far too much pepper in the... 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 air. Far too much? There is not enough! That chef has not cooked a good soup in ages. Pig here is terribly upset because of it. How am I to play croquet with the queen when Pig is hungry like this? Croquet with the queen? That sounds wonderful. Oh, Pig, behave yourself. This is one grumpy baby. That chef needs to get to work and make me a meal. <laughs> she named her baby Pig. What a rude name. Well, she's got a tall hat and we have a puzzle. So this puzzle totally confused me because I didn't realize. I was like, what is that? That's part of her hat. So this goes in the upper left-hand corner. So I think with this puzzle, we'll just go all the way down, if that makes sense. So I'll try to get the left-hand side done first. There we go. And then next, we're going to need her uh, neck and then her shoulders. So let's see. I could just move everything down like that. That will work perfectly. There we go. And there's the, the left-hand side of the board. So let's see. What goes in the corner? I'm, I'm, I'm not sure which corner... Hmm. Well, this must be the hat. I mean, this must be the top of the hat. And so that must be the window there. So let's try to get the uh, the top row filled in now, shall we? Let's see, I need to do it like this. Here we go. Get those two in place. And let's see, this is probably this piece here, right in the blue spot where the blue spot is now. Yes, yes, I think it's going to be the lower right-hand corner that's the uh, empty one. There we go. So solving that gives us a hidden objects challenge. Oh boy, I haven't seen one of these in a while. Let's see if I can find anything. Jeez, ancient book. Ancient book. Should be finding lots of keys. Large sapphire, large emerald. Brass knuckles. There's a key. There's a key. Good. Once I found some of the coins, I was able to uh, actually get moving on that. Uh, another key in Allen Wrench. Here's the Allen Wrench. You think a large sapphire would be easy to find, but no. Uh, silver? There it is. Dental mirror? That one? Great. Uh, silver coins and a key. There's the key. I'll use a hint for the silver coins. Oh, there they are. Hmm. Alrighty, so over on the right-hand side, we have a hidden objects challenge. I haven't seen one of those in a while. Uh, two monocles. Looks like we need to find a bunch of um, marbles as well. The 
loves paprikas, the item that we need to find. Uh, the clamshell's gonna go over here. I am still missing a lot of marbles. Um, butterfly is going to be here. Inkwell. Where's a golden inkwell? Shot glass over there. I'm not giving up, Victor. Don't be mean. I was just trying to find the inkwell, which is over there. All right, I'll use the menu uh, trick to get the two marbles. Oh, how are you supposed to know a marble's there? That looked like a part of the, the binoculars. All right, so let's go over here. What do you want? The Duchess says that your soup has been quite off lately. I lost my soup recipe and I have no idea where it is. A lost recipe is certainly a bother. I wonder if we can help. So this is going to be a little puzzle. We want to get the baby rattle and give it to Pig. That will make Pig happy. And that gives us the recipe. Now to find the ingredients for the soup. And that's over here in a hidden objects challenge. I haven't seen one of those in a while. I don't see any of these items. Okay, there's the clock face. Uh, there's the meat tenderizer. I'll use a hint, why not? There's a cow, of course there's a cow. Let's see. You'd think these would be easy to find, right? Okay, wine. That's not a wine bottle, I guess. There's a pepper shaker. Carrots and pickled onions. Ugh. I don't want to find those. They sound gross. So, let's just use uh, the cheat. Uh, you do have to worry about the cheat. Some It needs to touch the hint button before it's taken off your list of items to find. I don't know why that's a limitation of the game, but it is. I guess they didn't expect people to be like leaving partway through hidden objects challenges. Let's see if I can find a teapot. There it is. And lastly, the leg of lamb. Oh, and one ingredient is over here. Now let's make let's make this recipe. So this is another follow the pattern puzzle. So four, one, three, three. Four, one, three, three. Four, one, three, three, two. Four, one, three, three, two, four. Okay, thank goodness that was the last the ship, one. The indeed. You made the soup perfectly. <laughs> Great, I hope uh, the Duchess will like it. Finally, a good soup. This one has just the right amount of pepper and spices. This is a bit too much pepper for my personal liking. Find me outside and we can discuss this queen and this garden. Hmm. That might be the Cheshire Cat. Well, hello down there. Hello to you too. You must see me, but... I do not see you. Come now, you see. If you try a bit harder, I'm sure you'll see me. 
curiouser and curiouser. I've seen, I I've sometimes seen a cat without a smile, but it looks like now we're seeing a smile without a cat. <laughs> so, uh, middle button on the left, top button on the right, bottom button on the right. Those are the three buttons you press to solve the puzzle. Ah, well done, well done. Here I am, the Cheshire Cat. Now, what would you ask of me? Cheshire Puss, can you tell me, please, which way do I go from here to play croquet? Oh, have you not been invited? No, sir, I haven't. I have a clue for you, I think. Should you make it to the game, you will see me there. Curious. And, uh, he goes away? Oh, there's a gem there. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa! Mad Tea Party sign! I know exactly where I'm gonna be using that on the signpost. Let's go! Alright, let's meet the Mad Hatter. <laughs> Victor! This is simply an outrage. It must be dealt with immediately. I will not stand for it. Absolutely no good can come from any of this. Excuse me, sirs, but what seems to be the problem? <sighs> yes, no good at all. How could you possibly sleep at a time like this? A man in black has stolen the special teacups and ruined our tea time. How are we to have tea without the proper tea settings? Oh, he's stolen something from you too? I wonder if I might be of any help in finding them. You certainly will be helpful, Alice. And by that I mean, I'll do all the work. You just stay here. I'll, I'll take care of everything. So now we need to go across pretty much the entire game. Looking for, oh, there's a hidden object challenge there. Uh, looking for teacups, looking for teacups. So one's over here. So we need to get a shovel and the shovel was upstairs in, was it upstairs in the rabbits area? It was. Great, so that's gonna be the shovel to uncover that teacup. But first, a hidden objects challenge. <laughs> I haven't seen one of those in a while. So let's get all these items. That was a sewing needle. Uh, white boots. A ladle. A heart. Mirror. There's the heart. There are the tongs. Uh, umbrella and a monocle. There's the mirror. And then let's just use hints to... Uh, let's use the menu hints. So where was... I thought the buckle... buckle is over there, yeah. So that is not an umbrella, that must be cough syrup. And excellent, that's the umbrella. So what does that give me? A ladle. The ladle gets used somewhere, I don't remember. Oh, here's another teacup. See, was there anything uh, left to do with the puppy? Yes! Another teacup. That's good. Oh yeah, the ladle! The ladle's gonna be used in the Duchess's house with the stew. Let's go back to her immediately. Nice. So let's see, we are still, there's still something we can do in the Duchess's kitchen. A ship indeed. Hmm, well, I don't know what is still here in the, in the kitchen. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That mark got taken off of the kitchen, so we don't have to do something there. But we do have to do something with the caterpillar. So let's go back to the caterpillar now. I believe the caterpillar has a puzzle for us. So, we meet again. Sir, some very important teacups went missing and I'm trying to find them. I know a riddle of some brothers that were also lost in the woods. Answer it for me and I may be able to help you. 
All right, so this puzzle is... You need to... <laughs> Move this guy around. Like so. To get him to his house. I'm not sure where uh, where this puzzle comes from in uh, the Alice in Wonderland lore. Uh, perhaps this is... Uh, I don't know. Tweedledee and Tweedledum. Let's see. This is how we get to the next house. Ooh, this is a scary one. I need to move the map. Uh, I mean, I need to move the spider up so I can go right, up, left, down, left, and up to home. Of course, there's a giant spider up your home, so that's not good. Here you want to get the spider out of the way first, so try to move the spider into the hole. And then move our silly fellow to the home. Ah, and there's the brother. Okay, so the tar stops any moving object. It's just how that works. Let's see. So I guess here I want to have a, a character who's to the side. Let's see. Yeah, the side of the bush. Oh, got that guy home really easily. <laughs> yeah, so here, once again, I think we, we need somebody to the side of the bush. Let's see. I'm not sure what I'm doing here. Oh, there we go. Got that guy to the side of the bush, so I can move this one left and then down and then right. Let's see. Now I just need to get this guy lined up with the bush. Here we go. I'm not sure. I, I, I'm, I'm getting this bush. This is just a tricky one, I'm, I'm afraid. can't get this guy to line up here. That just doesn't work. If I get him to follow the bush like this... There we go, that's it. Okay, so we get them into two corners like that. And that way they're all lined up here. So I can move them left and right to get the guy back home. Sorry for taking so long. Well played, well played. I have something here that should help you. It's just a difficult puzzle, that's all. So, back to the tea party. Putting the teacups into place here. Oh man, and then this is a puzzle I don't quite understand. Okay, so the green is right of three and of those three gold is left of pink and red between red and blue is gold that doesn't make sense um yeah there we go red blue and then gold you found all the teacups then tea time shall commence at 2 30. however any time is tea time, and all the time, indeed. Oh, yes. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Are you still sleeping? This is a momentous occasion! Any time is a perfect time for tea, you see. Please take this gift to you from me. All right. I still don't quite understand that puzzle. It's like, okay, green is on the right next to three, but it's on the far right, so it's actually right of four. And while the clock face goes here, we're going to put the hand here, and then the other hand here. And this is a puzzle. You want to click on the hour hand until it's two o'clock, and then the minute hand until it's 2.30. So, 
simple enough. And then here we want to put all these gems that we've been collecting throughout the entire game. Put them in the correct spots. For one of these puzzles, you want to move pieces around and make matches of three. Like that. That's nice, that's nice. Let's see, that one there, that one there, that there, and that there. So here's the tricky one. These black pieces can't be moved, but the game doesn't explain that. So I think here we go like this to clear out this row. And then everything gets moved right once. And that gives us a key. So the final key? Could this be finally it? The door to the lovely garden? Not if I have anything to say about it. Oh no! Oh no! He made vines grow over the door! What a villain. But we already have some hedge trimmers, so we really don't need to worry. Cut away the vines, and then use the key for the queen's garden. Oh, it's a mess, I'm sure. All right, let's see if I got this correct. Yes. No. Oh, no, I got the outside one again. Um. Oh, oh dear. garden at last it's beautiful look out you're going to knock over the paint well it wasn't me he hit my elbow oh we're doomed the queen will be here any minute and we're out of paint oh it will be off with our heads off with their heads i wouldn't like that at all there must be more paint how strange. So we have talking playing cards, and they're trying to paint roses. They're painting the roses red. And I got a spear for the rabbit's house. So let's go back to the rabbit's house. That is where the spear gets used, correct? Yes, indeed. So now that we have the paint, we can paint the roses red. We have to do this puzzle three times, once for each card, and it's really simple. You just need to click on a rose to turn it red. And finally here. They're all red. You've done it. Oh, and not a moment too soon. Here she comes. The, the queen! queen! The, the queen! queen! Who is this girl? Alice, your majesty. Alice, you say? Off with her head! I think her head will stay in place and intact, my dear. Fine then, go. Can you play croquet? Yes, I can, your majesty. Very well. I shall see you there at the croquet grounds shortly. Excellent. Nurses! Everyone, get to their places and get their mallets ready. I do not seem to have a mallet, your majesty. Find a proper mallet or it's off with your head. Ah, uh, the queen seems very intent on decapitating someone today. Ah, Cheshire! So we meet again, I see. Oh, Cheshire Puss, I don't have the proper mallet to play croquet, and the rude queen is threatening me. Well then, I think I can help you with the mallet, but I cannot promise to help with the queen. Well, here's the mallet. It's a proper mallet. It looks like a pink flamingo. I 
have the proper mallet, your majesty. It would appear you do, and it's lucky for you. Let the croquet begin, or it's off with your heads! So this is basically a, a golfing challenge, very similar to the challenge in Nancy Drew's Secret of the Old Clock, although this is croquet and not golfing. Same basic idea, you want to hit your ball all over the area, and you don't want to go over par. So, our goal is to land it inside this hole. Oh, yeah! Whew, got lucky there. Okay, and then here I'm just gonna... Oh, almost! Oh, that, that, that was a failure. I'll just take a couple of straight shots there. Yep! Here, I'll shoot like this. Oh no. Let's see, do I go like here? Nope, messed up there. Mm, I might be able to make it though if I shoot here very well. I need some good timing. Oh, failure. I did get like through the cards, but that did not help. The card windmill. Oh wow, that wasn't a very good hit at all. Oh, the card windmill got me again. Let's see. I'm gonna have to do like a soft hit there. And now I can do, hey, hey, just jump from the left to the right. How did that happen? I think this is it. Gotta have good timing. All right. And now, yes. Woo. I do like how this one looks like uh, the Cheshire Cat. That's cute. And uh, that was a terrible shot. Oh, wow, well, this, this is not cute at all. Yep, we'll try again. Ah, uh, mini golf, my worst enemy. Oh god! <laughs> Okay, more like no way. Oh, so close. Uh... See, I'm trying to bounce it off that back wall, but the game is not accepting that as like an actual thing that worked. I, I didn't even see where the croquet ball went there. It, I think it got trapped inside the uh, Cheshire's cat, Cheshire cat's head. So here I'm gonna try to bounce uh, off the bottom. There we go. Oh, nope. That was a bad starting hit. Ooh, good. Ah! Oh, landed in the water. Okay, so here I'll do a soft shot. Oh, Mm. 
Uh. That wasn't a very good one. Let's see. Here, maybe I just need to go straight down. Yes. Got it. Whew. Shit! Shit! Off with her head! Excuse me, Your Majesty. I most certainly did not cheat. Come now, dear. I'm sure she didn't cheat at croquet. The treacle tarts! The treacle tarts have been stolen! The treacle tarts are gone? A trial! A trial shall be had! Come now, to the courtroom, and whoever did this, it's off with our heads! Alright, they gave us the final key here. So we're gonna go over here, use the key. Let's see, it needs to look like the justice symbol. Nope, got that one wrong. Ah. Why isn't this one in the middle? Like, the one in the middle doesn't seem to line up anymore. Ah. <sighs> Hope this isn't one that's impossible to solve. There we go. Yeah, see, now the one in the middle is like at a weird angle. Oh, now the one in the middle is at the perfect angle for lining that up. Yes. No. I think I'll just have to skip this one. And now let's go inside. Silence in the court! Oh no, oh dear. I seem to be missing my trumpet. The trial cannot start without it. Poor, poor rabbit. May I help you find it? My fur and whiskers indeed. Young girl, please take this and find my trumpet. So this is simple enough. We are going to use it here. Oh, maybe not as simple as I thought. Okay, so let's see. Uh, that one there. That like that. Here we're just going to move the red one all the way along the bottom row. Let's see. That one there. That there. Those like that. Those like that. Those there. See this. 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 Excellent. On that. There we go. Now for the trumpet. We have the trumpet. We're going to give it to the rabbit over here. Who is in this crowd? I think it's everybody, and then I'm not sure I recognize that. Let's see. That's the mouse. Uh, is that like a talking fish or something? You found it. Oh, my ears. The trial can begin. Let the trial begin. What is the accusation? The Queen of Hearts, she made some tarts all on a summer day. The Knave of Hearts, he stole those tarts and took them quite away. I've done nothing. I I'm innocent. I'm sure he did not steal the treacle tarts. That nasty man must be behind this. I wonder where he hid them. So now we have a really long puzzle. I feel like this probably could have been the 
big finale to the game finding all the uh, treacle tarts because we have to just go through everywhere everywhere in this game solve a bunch of hidden objects challenges and then sometimes they're out in the middle of just right there that one's just out in the middle no puzzle there uh, but here definitely it's hidden by a hidden objects challenge so uh, let's see if we can find any of these items monocle we had to find those last time Let's see, is there a pen and a spoon? And is the, uh, don't know what that is. Let's just use the menu cheat to get through here. Yeah, I don't see that treacle tart anywhere. There it is. Wow. Very well hidden indeed. Let's have the ring. Just when I clicked on that. Final thing is going to be the ring here. And there we go. Now let's check the map. Map says, uh, "Ooh, the glass chest has one." Let's go back there. Tweezers, spyglass, billiard ball. Blue taffy. I don't know why that taffy needed to be blue, but it did. Teacup, button hook. Um, looking for at least one item. Maybe the treacle tart. There it is. There's that treacle tart. And now let's just menu hint through this entire puzzle. That was a candle. That is an item we can't really see. It's just very hard to see. One more item, the final billiard ball. There it is. Good. Now for the caterpillar. Hello again. Is there something wrong? Sir, the trickle tots have gone missing. Missing something again? I know a riddle of lobsters once missing, dancing their way back home to the sea. If you solve it, I might be able to point you in the right direction. Alright, the dancing lobsters puzzle. The dancing lobsters are in Alice in Wonderland. I forget the context. The Lobster Quadrille, I think it's called. I, I could be totally wrong. So I, I'm not a huge fan of this particular puzzle, uh, simply because you, you have no idea how far we're done. How close am I to the end of round one? There we go, round two now. Also, it's a pretty unforgiving puzzle. Make one mistake and uh, you have to start the round over again. That puzzle's, uh, I mean, that problem's a little compounded by the fact that you don't know how close you are to finishing. Woo! I love the 
giant lobsters, and that apparently was a miss on my part. Got it. Yes. Ah. Timing's tough. No, not the end of round two yet. Now round three? No, okay. I totally felt like an ending point. Okay, maybe this is, no, 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 it can't be the ending point because we've got another giant lobster. Yikes. Done. No, not done. Round three. This is... I, I honestly can't tell the difference between the uh, various rounds of this challenge. <laughs> they all seem the same to me. Yikes. That's a tough one. Okay, that might be the end. That is the end. Hooray. Ah, very good. Very good. Indeed, I shall help you once more. Take this and be on your way. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Excellent. So, um, let's see. Anything we can do here in the Queen's area? No. Uh, the tree door. It looks like three hidden objects challenges and then the tree door. So... Fine. Three hidden objects challenges. Button. Let's see. Ladybug. Robin. Walking stick. Two ants. Cricket. Caterpillar. Dragonfly. Uh, let's see. I don't think we did this particular hidden objects challenge before. We're looking for sandwiches? Yum. Oh, there's a treacle tart. There's the ladle. Let's see. I need two candles and a sugar spoon. Somehow different from a normal spoon. Tea strainer and then cards. Okay, well, let's go over here. That's That's a nice one. We can just pick it up without any puzzle. I don't know, maybe they originally planned to have a puzzle there, but then they decided against it for some reason. Let's use a hint. Alright, back over here. That was a candle. I guess it was like a birthday candle. Yeah, both of the candles here are birthday candles. I guess that makes sense for a tea party. Does it? I'm not an expert on tea parties. Excellent. So, last hidden objects challenge. 
for now. Uh, I guess it's upstairs. So let's see, a treacle tart over there. We need to find some ladles, a crown, a carrot. Multiple carrots, actually. So I need a helmet. Is this a helmet? A cricket bat. Just waiting for my hint meter to fill up now. There's the other carrot. I, I mean, I seem to be doing pretty well without having to rely on hints. That's good. I still need a ladle and a cricket bat. There we go. There's my hint. There's the ladle. And now for the cricket bat. Oh, that thing. Oh, okay. Good. So now my map should say... Yeah, we're basically done. Except for the trial and the end game challenge. So we want to put all the tarts back. Done. As the jury reached a verdict. The trickle tarts are gone. Off with his head. They are not missing. The trickle tarts are right over there on that table. Enough. Who are you, barging in here like this? Off with his head! You wouldn't leave it alone. You just had to keep, keep fixing things, didn't you? I will destroy this story by any means necessary. There is no stopping Victor Vile this time, fiction fixers. Let go of me! Help! He took Alice. Quick, we need to find him. He had to leave something behind. You know, I'd almost forgotten Phoebe was one of our uh, helper characters. We haven't seen her in Look, quite so up long. Look, the ceiling. What is that? It's a puzzle. This is one of the tough ones, I think. Let's see. I want to move all these things around. There we go. That's not it. I feel like that was a really good one, though. Wait, did we get like a triple one somewhere? Ooh, nice. But that's not it. That's There's nothing connecting that one. Oh. You know, this might be a good place to show off the strategy guide that comes with the game. Which uh, will show you the solution to some puzzles, like uh, this one here. But you'll notice it's not, it's not the greatest. Can't really see in much detail. But it looks like it's gonna go, this is gonna go down and around and like that. So let's see if that will help. I'm sorry to anybody who thinks that that is so like major cheating on my part. How's that even work? Let's see, that goes down and around. There we go. Feels like I needed. Yeah, see this outside one, this this far right one isn't connecting. Nothing's connected to that far right one. Ah, uh, you know, I'm just gonna skip it at this point. Sorry. It looks like you activated some sort of portal. I bet this is where he went. Let's go. 
That one is just a tough puzzle. Whoa. Where did that portal take us? Come on, let's find Alice. I think it's Victor's home planet. Although I don't think he comes from another planet, so maybe that's just a silly thing for me to say. Anyway, we're going to find the orbs, the purple and green ones. I think those are the important ones here. We need to find a hand drill, a halberd, and an axe. A gauntlet, a saw. Oh, that's some armor. Yeah, um, all right. Getting close to done with this. There's the gauntlet. That's what a halberd is. And there's a handsaw. This is one creepy place. Alice must be here. We need to find a way inside. Alrighty, green here. Purple here. What? What do you mean that won't work? It works perfectly! So this puzzle you want to uh, move these various pieces around. So all the purple ones are on the left and all the green ones are on the right. Not the hardest puzzle ever. It can be a little difficult. Let's see, there we go. I'm trying to get that green piece out of the way. I've got the purple on the top. Uh, now I just need to switch this side with that side. And we should be okay. Alright. Done. The door is open. Let's get in there and stop him. Oh no! What is he doing to Alice? You're too late, fiction fixers. This device will drain the very essence of Alice and even Wonderland itself, allowing me to travel into more books and destroy more stories. There's nothing you can do to stop me. It looks like his device is powered by evil objects. If there was a way for you to get them out of there, you could shut it down. So... Look! There's a hole in the energy shield! Hurry! We have to stop him before Alice runs out of energy! This is the final challenge of the game. We have three hidden objects challenges in a row. And that's it. That's, that's how we win the game. So... Let's see if we can actually do this. Globe, a rat, a ring. I am not seeing any of these items. Magnifying glass. Um, there's a magnifying glass, but that's almost impossible to see. A rat, a bone saw. Copper wire. And rat. No, and copper wire. And last time I just need is a ring, so let me use the menu hint for that. Oh, that kind of ring. Okay. A mere setback. You won't stop me. So you think. Look! Another gap in the energy shield. So let's find this. We need to find a bunch of flasks. And what else? A black cat, a toad, 
some sort of weapon, it looks like. A compass, a scroll, a skull. Why is there a cow there, by the way? Uh... Maybe I won't ask too many questions about the, the various items that are here. <laughs> so where's a flask? <laughs> That's an eyeball, which is impossible to see. Let's use the menu hint for... That? Okay, I I thought I clicked on that, but fine. Try as you might, fiction fixers. I cannot be stopped. There's another gap in the energy shield. Hurry! Last one. Okay, spiders. Ooh, spiders. A pry bar street jacket. A frog, a skull. Books, books, spiders, spiders, forceps, gloves, gloves, bishop, and vacuum tube. That's a vacuum tube. Bishop is probably going to be the chess piece. Right? There's the glove. So let's use hint to get the final item. What? This can't be happening! Impossible! You did it! You stopped his machine! You may have foiled my plans this time, Viction Fixers, but you haven't seen the last of Victor Vile and the Illiterati! Quick, grab Alice and let's get out of here. Where is she? There she is! So, uh, he says, this isn't over. This will be continued. But he's wrong. This was the final game in the series. They only made two games in the series. So there was no sequel, even though there, I'm sure there are a bunch of cool books they could have made I into video games, like this one. There she is, safe and sound. <laughs> All in a day's work as a fiction fixer. Let's get back to the precinct. I'm sure the chief will want to hear all about this. Congratulations, Fiction Fixers. Wonderland is safe again. Give yourselves a pat on the back. Great job in there, partner. While I'm sure we haven't seen the last of him, you foiled Victor Vile's plans for now. We'll put aside as many resources as possible to find out where he went. You'll be the first to know if we hear anything. Now go take a break. You deserve it. Yeah. <laughs> it says to be continued, but it's not continued. That's so sad. I wish there was another game in the series. I forget what games, uh, what books people suggested. Like, Peter Pan. Yeah, it'd be fine. I was thinking the, the Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. That could be an interesting one as well. I'm, I'm not sure that would work. I don't know. Maybe it would work. So, uh, it took me an hour and 34 minutes to beat the game from start to finish. Uh, I think that time is a little bit off because I skipped a puzzle. So, you know, uh, they gave me 10 extra minutes because I skipped puzzles. Okay, so thank you very much. Hope you enjoyed seeing me play uh, Fiction Fixers Adventures in Wonderland.